6. A man shot by a police officer in North Miami earlier this week is getting ready to leave the hospital. Meantime, we're learning more about what may have led up to the shooting two days ago. CBS 4's Aurelia Ortega is live for us at Jackson Memorial Hospital with more. Aurelia? Elliot, I spoke with that man's attorney, and he says that he cannot believe that police mistook a white toy truck for a weapon. He says that white toy truck wasn't even in his client's hands. It was in the hands of an autistic man that he helps to care for. That man continues to recover here from a gunshot wound to his leg as friends visited him this afternoon. A man shot and injured by North Miami police, identified as Charles Kinsey, continues to recover at Jackson Memorial Hospital. Members of an organization he belongs to, the Circle of Brotherhood, are rallying for answers into what happened. We found out bits and pieces and we're still finding things out, so we just like to go see him. A CBS 4 News viewer took this picture as North Miami police responded to the scene Monday afternoon off Northeast 127th Street and 14th Avenue. In a news release, North Miami police said in regards to Monday's shooting, quote, there is preliminary information that North Miami police officers were dispatched to the scene after a 911 call was received of an armed male suspect threatening suicide. Arriving officers attempted to negotiate with two men on the scene, one of whom was later identified as suffering from autism. The other man was later identified as an employee of an assisted living facility, end quote. Kinsey is a caregiver at Miami Achievement Center for the Developmentally Disabled near where the shooting took place. His boss told us Monday Kinsey was walking with an autistic man he cares for when they were approached by police. To our understanding is the individual who lives here was walking down the street with a toy in his hand and somebody called the police saying someone had a weapon. North Miami police say at some point during the on-scene negotiations, an officer discharged his weapon, striking Kinsey. He was transported to Ryder Trauma Center with non-life-threatening injuries. The officer involved in the shooting has been placed on administrative leave. And North Miami police is asking for the public's assistance in this investigation. They are asking that anyone who witnessed what happened or has video or pictures to give them a call. The state attorney's office is also investigating the case. Meantime, Kinsey's attorney is holding a news conference as we speak. We'll bring you more on this story on CBS 4 News at 11. Reporting live from Jackson Memorial Hospital, Aurelia Ortega, CBS 4 News.